We're here with uh, Kid Kid and Shorty Lowe, the, the new G-Unit faces. What's going on with y'all? We in the building, man. What's happening? Now, uh, down. You, uh, you got a new single out. Tell us about that. Man, I got two of them. I got uh, Pocahontas featuring Twister Wale. You know what I'm He right here right now. Uh, one I just released uh, called All The Way Up featuring Stuart Rock. You know what I'm saying? I got Kid Kid right here. We got Janice right here. You know, everybody working on any projects with new movement, G Unit. Okay. And what project you working on right now that's going to come off? Basically, I'm working on my album right now. It's called Still Got Units. It's uh, due to be released in March. Uh, working on my album, I mean, my mixtape, uh, my uh, documentary on my life story. So I got a lot of stuff in the works right now. And Kid Kid, what you got going on right now? Oh, man, right now, man, I'm just working. Just working, working hard, you know what I'm saying? Ready to take over, you feel me? You already know, you know what I'm saying? Look for that, you know what I mean, Tony hit, Tony Yayo joint, you know what I'm saying? The haters meet, the big homie low, you know what I'm saying? We're doing the move. And now that, now that you with G-Unit, we gonna get some more features from East Coast, up north? Man, we get features from everywhere. I always have collab with a lot of people, man, but you know, it don't stop. We just working hard. Appreciate it, man. All right, man. Pop Wire here with a nominee for producer of the year, Kane Beats. What's going on, man? Kane is in the building. Man, that's what's up, man. You know the tag. I'm already feeling good. We out here. Atlanta. I'm just blessed to be here right now. I was here last year. I had nomination for a song of the year, so this year I'm nominated for producer of the year. So I'm just, you know, I'm happy to see like everybody, you know, respect my work ethic this year. So it's just been a blessing, you know what I mean? And from bottoms up to super bass, you know, you you the, you the chart topper. So what are you doing? What are you doing production-wise in the future? We should be looking for. Man, um, working on Rick Ross album. We just did something crazy. Working on Nicki's new album. Um, we got a new Roscoe Dash song just came out. It was good, good night. Um, working on Plies. Just did a record with Mike Foster. It was crazy. You know what I'm saying? And then you know, at the same time, I'm doing a lot of um, R&B, a lot of R&B, a lot of new different types of records. So, really, right now, I'm just working as much as I can. But I'm still in the studio every day trying to make it sound different because I feel one of the things that you know really helped me is none of my records sound the same you know what I mean so being able to create new sounds every time so that's what I'm trying to do right now right, hip-hop wire here with Travi what's going on y'all Bobbin alright so you gotta let us know what's going on with the new mixtape Different than three, man. Things drop. This thing crazy. so hard, boy. Man, got what? crazy features on there from Kelly Rowland, Wale, Big Sean. Um, Big Sean. That's the only thing I listen to, really. Yeah, for me real. I've been listening to that shit for four weeks already. <laughs> like, damn. And you mentioned a track with Kelly Rowland. Now, did y'all get to work with Kelly Rowland, or she sent no, it to her first? Actually, she just she just heard uh, like Bring It Back and stuff. She was like, man, I want to work with them. Like, mm -hmm. yeah, she so, said. And then we so had just, one for. We had a song for her already. She just threw a vocals on. And said, it back. Yeah. I mean, smash, smash, smash. But everybody else, we was in the studio with. Them. Yeah. Yeah. And somebody brought up the comparison to Two Live Crew. Y'all see yourselves as this generation's a Two Live Crew? I mean, we made the girls go crazy. Yeah. <laughs> we the new, we the new Travis Porter, man. You know, <laughs> we the new Travis Porter. Yeah, yeah, and we man. gonna continue to make people have fun, man. And you said the girls go crazy. I've been seeing the tour videos. What's one of the craziest things that's happened while y'all was on tour? on YouTube. Yeah, man. There's a lot of crazy <laughs> stuff that goes on. Yeah. For real. I don't even want to say it. I'm not saying it. <laughs> All right, y'all. Appreciate it. Hip Hop Wire here with Slaughterhouse. We got Crooked Eye right now. What's going on, man? So y'all right. doing the Shady Cypher? Yeah, I already know. Shady Cypher shut it down. And the boss got ill. I'm going to tell you right now. I'm going to tell you right now. M, he's shutting the whole shit down. Sorry. Now, tell us about the new album and the new deal. It's beautiful, man. It's something that we all dreamed of, you know, being part of his hip hop culture, and, and having and having somebody who believes in what we what we really do. You know what I'm saying? I know, not no stuffed shirt suit that don't know nothing about hip hop. You know what I mean? Somebody who went through the fucking trenches is our motherfucking CEO. So we can't never downplay that. You know what I mean? That's a blessing, bro, for real. And y'all go hard, but being with Shady now, you ever feel like you need to go even harder? You well, we, we go harder every time out anyway, so it's no pressure because we all in there having a blast. I mean, tell them again, crook. I mean, I can quit. <laughs> tell them one more time. Now, y'all doing the cypher, though, and I know y'all group, but who you think go hardest in the cypher? Him. 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 Him and I keep telling niggas the boss the did it. <laughs> best rapper in the world show why he's the best rapper in the world. Best dead and alive or just alive? Best rapper in the world. If you're dead, you're not in the world. <laughs> 